Hello everybody fishing fanatic. I know it's been a long time since I made a video, but I just wanted to show you um, I'm out here today. Today is Sunday, March the 18th and Caught a nice little bass here See this little fish here was caught just fishing in some water out here just right along the edge of this little bank right here I just saw it there and presented a few casts to it and got it on the second time it actually took the lure So we're gonna see if we can get some more action here All right, ladies and gentlemen, got another bass here. Hopefully you can see, this was a nice size one here, putting up a nice little fight. Good sized bass. And it appears to be hooked well. So let's get her out of the water here. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. That's a good, good fish there. Very nice. And one of the things that I do is I always, this is just myself, my personal preference, but I always crush down the barb to make removing the hooks a lot easier and less dangerous to the fish, less harmful, should I say, to the fish. But that is a beautiful little fish there. Just take a look at that. Nice bass to catch today. All right, let's let her go. Away she goes. She's doing fine. Okay, let's put this on pause. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we've got another fish out here today. Hopefully you can see it coming up here. It's a good little fish. Breaking the surface there a little bit. You can see the lure I've been using. Basically about a four and a half inch worm. So again, with the hooks pushed down, it's a good little fish there. Good little fish. Let's let her go back. And away she goes. Got another one here. Nice little jump there. Good bass, good bass. Just slowly, slowly hopping the little worm. You can see it coming up the line there on a uh, you know, little six inch, maybe at maximum of one foot hops. But you see the kind of uh, action we get here then. Good little fish, very nice little fish. And again, hopefully, look at that. Look how easy that hook comes out. And yet, I really don't, having experienced any uh, greater loss ratio of using a barbless hook versus a barb hook. So, and it sure is a lot less damaging to the fish when you use a barbless hook. So again, that's just my personal preference, certainly not telling you what to do, but it certainly works for me. So let's let her go back again. And... Away she went, no problems. Let's try to get another one. 